committee reports. We'll go over the minutes of uh, our regular meeting of January 6th and the special meeting of January 15th. I'm going to second. So we'll be second to approve the minutes for January 6th. All in favor? Aye. Opposed? Aye. 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 Special meeting minutes for the special meeting of January 15th. I'll move forward. I'll second. We'll be second to approve the minutes for the special meeting of January 15th. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Aye. Moving on to the consent calendar. Item A, B, C, and D. I'll move approval of the consent calendar. I'll second. Thank you. Move second to approve item B, A, B, C, and D for the consent calendar. Does the maker, does the motion maker uh, substitute the new A that we had on the last night for the Yes. And that's fine. I'll motion is amended to include the uh, update. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carried. Board business. 9A. Thank you, President Board and members of the board. Uh, 9A is our standing item. It's an opportunity for the board to discuss any changes that you may wish to. Uh, Consider for the job action plan that's in place. Um, so uh, this is this is that opportunity to, to discuss that. I don't know that we necessarily need to change anything that's working quite well, but I would say it's important that we emphasize that the drought is obviously not over. Um, I mean that great amount of rain we got sure as heck helped, but didn't put it into the uh, reservoir, so I... All that global, about 10 days I think it Yeah, the Well, we'll be able to affirm that back in 9B, where we, uh, <laughs> <laughs> where we continue, where we continue to be where right. the points are all taken. Do you have any direction? Yeah, the other action is to speak about it. Item 9B. Accept the water supply and demand the drought response action plan status reports. Item 9B. Community drought emergencies. Thank you. Um, we prepared a report that he has typically done for the board each month. Uh, a couple of things I would uh, like to mention. Uh, you probably heard the State Department of Water Resources increase the uh, anticipated allocation from 10% to 15% last Thursday. Um, we have been told by Zone 7 that they will not notify us on what their deliveries will be until probably the April time frame. So we have requested deliveries for 2015, but we do not have it. Um, any determination of that from them on whether they will able to meet those deliveries or whether they will be signed level of conservation of the proposed performance. So uh, the, uh, this particular item, we typically ask for the board by motion to accept the water supply report and find that there's still a need for the community draft emergency. So if you have any questions, I'll be glad to try to answer those. Oh, I would also like to mention, John shared with me some uh, data that we thought would be interesting to the board. Um, we did an analysis of how much our water conservation uh, had reduced Tier 1, Tier 2, and Tier 3 usage uh, in 2014 compared to 2013. Our Tier 1 usage was basically flat, not much change between the two years, but our Tier 2 usage in 2014 was 29% less, and our Tier 3 usage was 79% less in 2013. We saw an overall reduction of 27.98% in 2014 usage compared to 2013. Tier 3 was 79% less. Okay. Yeah. So questions or comments? 
you covered it very well. The only thing I might add is that I'm sure you Gonzalez, the special community affairs specialist for Alameda County Water District, gave her report, which presented a lot of data, which is covered in the reports to, to our district. But uh, the impact of the drought is obviously affected them just like it has um, our district. Other than that, um, at this time we're going to close session. Yeah. 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 No, I don't. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> she usually does. I'm sorry. I apologize to me. I got to remember that trick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, with no further comments or reports from the board, now we'll go to the closed session. Uh, for uh, items 11A and B, do not exceed the consent calendar. And we are going to add John Marshall to the list. In his new capacity as administrative services manager. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.